Hello folks, this is Bob and in this video I'm going to show you how to start making your SWEP. We're going to prepare our SWEP, we're going to give it the view model, our world model, and uh, iron sights and information like that. So let's get going. Moving right along, we're going to go to Lua, Weapons, and here are our weapons. I'm going to copy my empty assault one. Copy and paste. I don't want to overwrite it, and I'm just going to copy over it. I'm going to give it a name. We're going to call this Test Rifle. Uh, don't put a space in your uh, in your folder name here for your SWEP, otherwise it won't get read in the game. And it'll go open shared. Oh yeah, that reminds me. Files we're going to need to do this part of the SWEP making process. Well, obviously, you can see I'm working with uh, Notepad++. We're also going to be using Clavis's SWEP construction kit. There's going to be a link for that in the uh, description as well. Clavis, if you can hear me out there, you're awesome. You're a freaking genius. I don't know how you pulled that shit off. Hats off to you, man. Anyway, moving right along, we got, uh, we got variables here we're going to be editing all the way down. You can see I already put information here along with the variables to tell you what you're going to be doing. If you could read, you can do this. It's really not that hard. In fact, you could skip forward until we start editing this part of the swept down here, the view model and the world model. But I'm just going to do it anyway because some people out there need to have their hands held. I ain't doing this forever, guys. Test rifle, same name as the folder. Category, let's give it a test. Yet. Okay, view model. Here we're going to have to choose what view model we're using. Do you remember how we hex and gave it a new name? I'll go to models, weapons, and let's choose our view model. V underscore test underscore gun. V test gun dot MDL. You need that dot MDL there. If dot MDL is missing, you will get a giant error and people will not like you. World model. Okay, guys, this is a Counter Strike model. It is not rigged up properly with bones to work in Gary's mod, so if you try to use the straight model as it is right now, W underscore test gun or W test gun silencer, it'll be sticking out of your crotch. And in another video, I'll probably show you how to fix that. It requires uh, 3DS Max, but anyway, there is a way around that, and that's why I'm using Clabs' Swept Construction Kit. So let's just use a generic model right now. I'm going to use W underscore SMG1. I think it's SMG1. Yeah, we'll see. I'm going to make show view model off. Turn it invisible. Off. False. Turn it invisible so no one can see it. Sweat base. You see, I renamed my base here. Please rename the base when you do it. You're going to get uh, errors from other people's add-ons if you don't. Oh god, if you don't rename the base, shame on you. Okay. Primary sound. Ah, yeah, this is the sound that we're going to use when we're using, uh, when we're firing off our gun. What's your name need again? Lua, auto run, auto run file. Ah, uh, yeah. Test gun shot. There should be another, uh, variable here for silent sounds, but. I have to add that in later, so I'll just make silence false. Yeah, silence false. Okay, RPM's good, clip size, kick up, yeah. Uh, kick up, kick down, or horizon uh, kick horizontal, that's how much it's going to push your screen every time you fire. I'll leave it automatic. Zoom is fine too. Okay, that is that. And with some luck, we'll have a uh, working swept with our fresh new model when we get into Gary's mod. I'll save this. I'm going to start up the game, and when I get there, I'll resume this video, and we'll see what happens. Okay, guys, I'm back. Now let's see what happens when we try to give ourselves the weapon we've been working on. I'm going to go to weapons. Test category is here. That's a good thing. Demonstration rifle. Well, hot dog, how do you like that? Oh, shit. Got to reposition this real quick. Our rifle is here. Unfortunately, is he, uh... He's being held left-handed, but we could fix that. 
going to go to our swap here and let's take a look at what we can do. View model flip is currently false, but let's make that true. Save. Oh, how do you like that? It's moved over already. Life is good. Now, what else do we need to do? Well, we don't have running or zoom angles, so let's give ourselves some running and zoom angles. Please forgive me while I adjust some stuff. Camtasia, just moving the window over. Oh, that works. Now we need to work with the swept construction kit. So let's go to other swept construction kit, and there we are. Click. I'll go to weapon, and we're going to choose our view model. All the way down, weapons. V. What was the name we gave it? Ah, yes, V underscore test gun. We do want this model. Give it a flip, just like we did before. Our field of view is 70. That's why I put it in here, right? Yes, field of view 70. If you're going to adjust your field of view, be sure to make it the same in both places so you get the same iron sight positions. Let's move this over here. Nah, I'll leave it as it is. It's just good enough. And just like it says, hold right mouse to drag iron sights. Just that easy. Now I like to get my stuff fine-tuned, so I go in here click and drag, and you can move the mouse up and down to make the movements even finer. That's good enough for me. Let's bring it back a little bit. No, I don't know. Do that here. Then move the yaw over this way. You see, this is uh, all possible because of Clavis's construction kit. This guy's a genius. I don't know how he figured this stuff out. Anyway, you can see I got the little red dot covering the uh, center of our target rectangle there, so we're going to copy the iron sights right down here at the bottom. Copy iron sights, go to clipboard. And if you move this over, you'll see code copy to clipboard in our chat print. Cool! Let's go alt tab back here, scroll on down, and this is the part we're going to edit. Ah, shit. I'm just going to paste over that. Good enough. Now we need our running side positions and angles. You know the angles that we're going to have as we run around. Well, reset iron sights and give ourselves some angles that almost look like we're running or holding it in poor position right in front of us. I don't know. Whatever you choose. I'm not going to hurt anyone's feelings. That looks good enough for me. Now you see we're going to have to rename Iron Sights Pause and Ang to Run Sights Pause and Ang. I'm just going to do a quick copy and paste. Copy, paste. I'm going to delete this crap. Delete. And save. Now for these to take place, we're going to have to restart the game we're in. I don't need this anymore. Close view. Open you up, reload, and now we wait. I guess I should have waited to do this. Now, weapons, damn it, test category, a demonstration rifle, right there where we wanted it. Ah, damn it. I can't get a break for anything. Looks good. Sprinting position looks good enough for me. And our sound. Cool. Semi automatic. Pow, pow. Looks awesome. You now have a working sweat. But we're not done. We still got to take care of our world model. But we'll get there in the next video.